Coming to you from FBA at Shannon Forest, Studio Ignite. This is Crusader Network News. Good morning, Crusaders. I'm Noah. And I'm Luke. It's Thursday, April 4th, 2024. Here's your news from around the school. The lower school students will have spring pictures made Friday, April 5th. Students may wear spring clothing for the pictures, but they must follow the school dress code. There will be an early dismissal for the lower school on Monday, April 8th at 2 p.m. Students staying at the school after that time will be able to view the partial solar eclipse together. That's right. Parents are welcome to view the eclipse with their child at the school. Late stay will carry on as usual. Students will be given a special glasses to view the eclipse in a safe manner. I'm really looking forward to that. Me too. Our fifth graders will be heading to Banner Island April 8th through April 10th. They will be studying the ecosystem of the coastal area and see lots of wildlife. I hear they're going to get in a mud pit. That sounds awesome. I know. We have lots of field trips coming up. The fourth, grader, the fourth grade class have a field trip to Kings Mountain planning for Thursday, April 11th. Your last name's King. Is that your mountain? Maybe so. Our third graders are going to Columbia on Friday, April 12th. That's my class. I remember doing that. The second graders have a in-house field trip on Friday, April 12th. They will be gem mining. That sounds like a lot of fun. I remember doing that last year. The, the Crusader Station Spring Program is Friday, April 12th. And the Lower School Music Showcase will be on Tuesday, April 16th. Here's our FBA chorus member, Ben Cooper, to tell us more. Our Crusader Station Spring Program will be coming up on Friday, April 12th at 9.30 a.m. And our Lower School Music Program will be Tuesday, April 16th at 6 p.m. Both programs will take place in the upper school gym. Students should wear dressy, casual clothing. Lower school students and parents who've been asked to participate in the dancing part of the show need to wear soft sole shoes so you can dance on the gym floor. FBA families are invited to attend the programs. There will be a lot of fun music and awesome entertainment. Hope to see you there! Thanks, Ben. I know it will be fun time for everyone. Looking ahead, Lower school standardized testing will be April 18th through April 24th. More information will be coming soon. Now it's time for our birthdays. Here's Hale Blackwell to tell us who to celebrate this week. We have several birthdays to announce this week. Second grader Asher Chapman celebrated her birthday March 21st. Fifth grader Elizabeth Lucero is celebrating her birthday today. Third grader Claire Petruso has a birthday tomorrow, April 5th. K5 friend Rosie Smith turns a year older Saturday, April 6th. And first grader Mia Scala will celebrate her birthday Tuesday, April 9th. Happy birthday! Thanks, Hill. We'll bring you one of these cool birthday pencils from our friends at Crusader Network News. It's time for the Guess Express game. Here's Karis to let us know who had the closest guess. It's time for the Guess Express game. Last week, we showed you this bag of polytrons and asked you to guess how many you thought were in here. We had a lot of great guesses. We have a winner. Congratulations to Miss Hastings' third grade class. They guessed 120 polytrons. There were actually 114. So they were really close. We'll bring you goldfish for your prize sometime soon. There will be a new container of items on the next show. Thanks for jumping on the Guess Express.
Thanks, Karis. Congratulations to Mrs. Hastings' third grade class. We hope you enjoy the goldfish. We all know how spring weather is, right? Cool in the morning and warm in the afternoon. That means we wear a sweater or jacket to school in the morning, and then we forget to take it home at the end of the day. Or better yet, we leave it in the playground or at, in PE class. Then they probably end up in the lost and found. Well, our lost and found is out of control. Here's Candler Putman with a look at what's in there. There's so much stuff in lost and found. There's sweaters, jackets, Shrek headbands, glue sticks, another jacket, water bottles, sweatshirts. There's even more stuff. There's blue jackets, red jackets. I think this is even a Shannon Forest hoodie. There's navy ones. There's ones with hearts on them. There's red ones, more red ones. There's fluffy ones. There's winter coats. There's white sweatshirts, orange sweatshirts, navy jackets, and so much more. We have jackets and sweaters that are hanging too. We have navy ones, we have gray ones, we have green ones, we even have pink ones, white ones too. And there's gray coats, and, and there's just flat out white t-shirts. Look at all these water bottles. I want one of these. Lunch boxes, unicorn keychains, even basketballs. Is any of this stuff yours? Come check out Lost and Found soon. Thanks, Candler. You really need to check that out. Throughout the year on Crusader Network News, we lift up in prayer all our lower school teachers and students. Here's Finn Brown with our Terrific Ten! plus three for this week. Each week on Crusader Network News, we will lift up in prayer specific students and teachers. The Bible tells us to encourage one another and build one another up. One of the ways we can do that is through prayer. Here are our terrific 10 plus three students and teachers for this week. Third grade teacher, Miss Mills. K-5 friend, Aria Gothry. Third grader, Noah Elias. First grader, Mia Scala. LDP teacher, Miss Harris. Third grader, Lacey Higdon. First grader, Lila Putnam. K-5 friend, Wyatt Davis. Third grader, Danielle Arthurs. Second grader, Wyatt Massey. Third grader, Clara Fischuso. Fifth grader, Carly Goodman. Fifth and fifth grader, Luke Meyer. Please post these names somewhere in your classroom to your mind and who to pray for this week. We will give each of these students and teachers a special wristband like this to wear as a reminder that we are praying for them and that God loves them very much. Thanks, Finn. We're thankful to be able to encourage our friends through prayer. We'll bring you the wristband sometime soon. That's our show for today. Remember to always try our best and do everything in a way that brings glory and honor to God. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next week. Remember, Remember to recycle in your classrooms. Go Crusaders!